So I wanted to talk about what DER is quickly and then how DER relates to ADMS and DERMS. So DER is Distributed Energy Resources and fundamentally it's just energy resources distributed throughout the distribution system of a grid. And so that might look like some bulk PV that's connected to a distribution system, utility or privately owned, you know, some industrial controllable loads. Some of those industrials might have some distributed generation as well as various energy resources, including electric vehicles out connected to our residential homes. So the fundamental difference between ADMS and DERMS is very simple. It's actually just this. ADMS is an advanced distribution management system that manages a utility's distribution system. There's some advanced capabilities there like automated switching and even some underlying modeling, electrical modeling to do load flow um, analysis in advance of that automated switching to make sure it's going to work out okay. DERMS is Distributed Energy Resource Management System that controls all of the things on the other side of the meter. So on the customer side of a meter for a utility, for instance. And that might be you know, set points for things like solar plants, BESS, load shedding, uh, specific to controllable loads and industrial and homes, and even maybe aggregated control of residential BESS so that a whole Re, um, a whole neighborhood might act as a single bulk best system. So fundamentally, that's the difference between DERMS and ADMS.